Hello everybody, this is Traven here. I'm going to book my travel trip. No, 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 no. Today I'm going to share with you something more important than just to travel because I'm going to share with you the sexiest company I ever come across. Why is it so? Because there's this company having 99.3 gross margin. Let me repeat one more time. 99.3 gross margin. What does it mean? If you don't understand, you can simply Google what is a gross margin. All right. Anyway, this is gross margin. It is the revenues after subtracting all the cost of goods. Okay, let me show you this. You have to look at this. 10 years ago, it was like 50% and now it's 99.3% gross margin. And the revenue, you see how the revenue grow? Oh my God. And EPS, earning per share, to see whether this company has the earning power or not. Are they making money or not? From 10 years ago, 3.74 and see, how have they grown? Oh my god, currently it's a 55.79 as the latest quarter. How about cash flow? Are they receiving money? Free cash flow, very important. No point making money, but money is not coming in, right? So let's look at a free cash flow. Look at this, look at this. 297, 10 years ago to now what? 4975. Oh my god, very healthy, constantly increasing. But of course, we have to check whether they have high debt, high debt or not. In this case, unfortunately, it's a bit on the high side, more than 0.5. But I think overall it's still fine because I do check against on the crown ratio which is above 2. That's overall pretty healthy. And guess which company is this? Booking Holdings. What? Yes, Booking Holdings which means they literally owns Booking.com and all, not all, but uh, a few other websites like for example, Booking.com, Priceline, Kaya, Agoda, alright. What? They made 81.2 billion in gross booking last year. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is like too sexy already. And how about look at their share price? BKNG share price. What? The earning orders are so fantastic, yet yeah, the price was like ups and downs. And it's nearer to the all time low at uh, 1860 plus. Of course, long term is always on an uptrend, good company always go up. But in the short term, I don't know what news causes them to be hit so badly. But then looking back again on the numbers, it looks very sexy. But of course, do be reminded that today is actually 5th November and they are going to report their uh, earning uh, just after today market close. So let's check what's their past history. Oh my god, a year ago they reported this, which is better than the consensus forecast. They reported this and better this and better this and better they always always beating giving surprises positive surprises to the analysts and hence strong recommendation but i don't believe just in analysts i look again on the numbers and i'm familiar with booking holdings i use it for my you know travel and all that right so this is a company that i would definitely be keen to collect and if the earnings uh tomorrow i mean tonight are uh, the price drop, this is when I will enter so much more again, one more time. Alright, so this is all I wanted to share with you. Our job as an investor is really to collect great businesses at fair price. Alright, you rather want to have a great businesses at fair price rather than a fair company at a great price. Alright, so great company, just buy and hold. Alright, see you then. Thank you, bye-bye.